All right guys, uh, welcome to a quick tip from Tractor Tips. I just wanted to show you in this one uh, a little bit about the effects and uh, how to save a little bit of time in loading your effects up during a live set. So if we go in and into preferences first of all and into uh, the effects settings in the preferences you'll see the effects pre-selection area and there's a whole bunch of effects listed here and those effects on the right hand side are the effects that you will see when you head on to the drop down of the effects and you have all these effects to choose from if you're using the X1 um, the shift and the button up here will switch those effects through and you'll just sort of browse through every effect um, if you're wanting to do this while you're on, on the fly and DJing live, uh, there's quite a few effects to go through. So it can be quite a process to get to the next one, other than just clicking the mouse and dragging to whichever effect you want. So to keep it simple, there's probably only a few effects that you really use. So we head back into the preferences again, um, and into this effects section right here. And we can just uh, select a multiple a uh, bunch, we can even hit the top one uh, then press shift on the very bottom one and it will select all the effects and then we can just remove them all so then if we go back into the effects there's actually no effects available to us so back on into preferences again and we just select whichever ones that you tend to use the most of again you can use uh, the command key on a Mac and uh, select whichever effects um, that you want use the command and then click um, so let's say I'm just going to use these effects in my set tonight and then I can just add those and that's them added job done so we'll go on into the effects unit and you can see there's only the selection that I made and back on the X1 really quick to flick through and just find the ones you want so that's a real quick way to uh, minimize and save some time on your live sets thanks for watching